I'm Lady T506. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm attempting to do a ponytail roller set. I tried to do the regular roller set and it was taking forever, like an hour. This I got done in about 15 20 minutes. I got, I think, eight ponytails and roller on each. This may not be the size rollers that I, I'm supposed to have, but. Y'all gonna have to worry about me. I'm roller setting my hair and then I'm gonna flat iron it. And y'all may be asking why am I, you know, roller setting if I'm gonna flat iron it. Well, this way my hair can get at least a little straight so that the flat iron won't take so long. So let's pray that, you know, these rollers are dry because I was under that dryer for like an hour and whoo! You know, ladies and gentlemen, when you get up under that dryer as hot as I don't know what. Whew. That one looks fine. And if I'm not looking at the cameras because I'm looking at the mirror right behind the camera. Make sure everything's alright, see? Keep your fingers crossed that I won't have to go up under that torture chamber. So far, so good. Okay, now I'm looking like I'm about eight years old for picture day. So far, so good. Yes. Don't look like I'm going back under the chamber. I'll be back when I have all of them out. Okay, I'm back and took all the rollers out and had to get back up under the torch chamber because some of the roller well the rollers were not dry. So I'm gonna try to flat iron my hair. Usually I don't do this. It's usually my mom does it. But I'm going to try to do it today. And I'm going to be using the cheap pink dazzle. If you hear noise in the background, that's just my little cousins. And they're harassing each other. You want to Comb through it. Then I like to take the comb and just go like, like about that. Well, let me just try to just fly the iron. Oops. Go that one more time. This is the way I get my hair straight in. I haven't had a part room in almost 10 years. And I see some of these girls on YouTube who are natural and they have their curls just popping and I've tried to do it and I don't know if it's because my hair is long or what or I'm not using the right products but I've tried doing a braid out, twist out, be trying to have my hair, my natural hair and it stated it is in and it was a uh, whoo. It was a mess, I can tell you that. So that's why I just, you know, keep my hair flat ironed because I guess it's more manageable for me. But I tried to twist out some of the braid outs, and man, I was thinking for a minute that hey, I could probably do that. Get my hair twist out, do a braid out. At first, I was like, well, maybe I'm not. Letting the braid out or twist out stay in long enough. 
at one point I had a braid out in for like five days and it didn't do anything. Now I'm going to take this whole section that I've already done and go over it one time. Y'all hear music in the background. Forgive that. That is my nephew's pot that has decided to go off without anybody messing with it. So I'm just assuming that the barriers with it. So just act like y'all don't hear that noise. I'm going to finish this section and I'm going to come back when I'm done. Okay. I'm finally done with my hair. Just finished flat iron. I haven't put anything on it yet, but I am going to be using this organic root stimulator, olive oil, enriched with moisturizing hair lotion. Put that on my hair. About that much. I know my hair is looking like really, really thick now, but put a little more because my hair is like really, really thick. After I've oops, I'm right there, put the moisturizer out throughout my hair. And brush it real good. Hold on, let me find my brush. I got this brush. It's like a hard side and a soft side. Just like brush my hair. Let it get all soaked in. Let all the moisturizer go through and make sure you work on your ends. Learn that also watching YouTube. Make sure get it all over there, get it all over your ends. Make sure your hair is very, very moisturized. And what I used to roll up my my rollers was the organic root stimulator wrap set mousse just put that on there and did like regular ponytails i believe i had eight of them and just rolled them and clipped them because i've tried more than once without using rubber bands and it just wasn't working so I was like i've seen videos on youtube where the girls they were using ponytails and it got done so I was like, maybe I should be doing that because I hate, you know, blow drying my hair and getting it dry like that. And yeah, granted, I'm under, when I put the rollers in, I get up under a hard cat dryer, but, you know, it's not that direct heat from it, even though it is very, very hot up under the dryer. But I'd rather do that for like 50 minutes, maybe an hour, instead of just blow drying my hair. I think that's very damn. I don't think my hair turned out really good with me actually doing my own flat ironing and everything so I guess I'm becoming better at it I don't know if you can see my hair but if I take the camera off of the sand maybe you can so without breaking it came out and it didn't take as long as I want as long as I went, as long as I thought it would, but yeah, I think I did a very good job. I hope you like this video. Hope this video was informative for all. I want you to thumbs up, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, and share. This is Lady T signing off. Have a good one.